Hey there folks, this is uh, Red Shirts and welcome to a tutorial about how to save in Metal Gear and Metal Gear 2 Solid Snake. Uh, according to my other video which uh, tells you how to uh, save your save game, uh, which is also not necessary anymore as far as I can tell, in uh, Metal Gear Solid in the Master Collection, uh, I've also seen a lot of questions about all the saving in all the games in the Master Collection of uh, the Metal Gear of Part 1. So uh, let's just dive into that. First. Right here, we're gonna have to see. Uh, we're gonna look, be looking at Metal Gear, um, whereas um, the uh, pivotal point here is the elevator. Every time you step into an elevator in this game, doesn't matter how often you do it, that is a new checkpoint that is created. So when you, I was I was playing the PC version here. So when you open up the in-game pause slash save menu that they added for the uh, emulation part, and I am not 100% sure what the buttons are on consoles and such, but I believe it's L1, L2 at the same time. I'm gonna have to try that out. But on PC it was Tab. It took me a while to figure that one out, because it doesn't say anywhere. There's no explanation about this, so I see where the <laughs> where the confusion comes from. Um, but after you en uh, exit, entered and exit, just to be sure, uh, the elevator, you can go Tab, uh, Save Data, and Save Your Game. Uh, so now if you load it back up, uh, you go back to the save state that you had last time you exited, entered slash exited the elevator on the game. So if you exit an elevator, do stuff, press save and use quit, you lose all the stuff you did from the moment you exited that elevator. So keep that in mind. Enter an elevator, just to be sure, exit it and then save, because otherwise it's just pretty darn useless. Um, after that, we're going to be looking at Metal Gear Solid, uh, no sorry, Metal Gear 2 Solid Snake. I hate the naming of these games at some some points, but um, it's a bit easier, still kind of annoying. Also, for the PC version I had here, same button, you press tab, in-game menu, save data. But, no elevator this time. Um, for this game, it's after every time you enter a new area, so you have the 9... Uh, dots area you see in the radar. Um, if you go to new nine dot area, that's a new area. If you save then, you save from that point on. Uh, cutscenes, after a cutscene, you have saved if you press save data. But um, if you do stuff in the nine, uh, nine square area, you do not go to a new part, you do not get a cutscene or anything of the sorts, and you press save, it will not have saved anything you have done. So, entering a new area in this one, and cutscenes. Keep those in mind and after that you save. Um, I hope you uh, enjoy that. Uh, there will also be Metal Gear Solid 1 and 2 and then after that Metal Gear Solid Snake Eater will be added to the mix as well in another video. Uh, I'll see you then. Bye.